The Nuclear Security Summit attracts world leaders as they converge on the Water Washington International Conference Center. President Muhammadu Buhari is leading the Nigerian delegation and is seen here exchanging banters with other world leaders. The large turnout is because of the importance of the issue of nuclear energy to world peace, while some nations of the world are said to be employing nuclear energy for development purposes, others are using it to pose a threat to the collective security of the world. And this is of serious concern to President of Burma and the Prime Minister of Netherlands. Our nations have made some 260 specific commitments to improve nuclear security. And so far, three quarters of these steps have been implemented. More than a dozen nations have removed all their highly enriched uranium and plutonium. Countries have removed or dispersed uh, disposed of several tons of this deadly material. Nations have improved their nuclear security, including stronger regulations and more physical security of nuclear facilities, and more nations are cooperating to prevent nuclear s smuggling. Leading up to this summit, nations have fulfilled additional commitments. Argentina, Switzerland, Uzbekistan all successfully eliminated all their highly enriched uranium from their countries. China recently opened its new center for promoting nuclear security and training. And I'm pleased that the United States and China are cooperating on nuclear security. And Japan is working to complete the removal of more than half a ton of highly enriched uranium and plutonium, which is the largest project in history to remove nuclear material from a country. The material that is out there is being made more secure as more countries turn the IAEA's recommendations into national legislation. Since the The Hague Summit, 37 have committed to doing so. Most recently, Jordan and China. President Buhari sends in a statement pledging Nigeria's continuous support for multilateral efforts aimed at promoting a common approach and commitment to nuclear security at the highest levels. President Buhari tells the gathering that to enhance nuclear security, Nigeria has reinforced its cooperation with the International Atomic Energy Agency, the United States Department of State's Partnership for Nuclear Security, and the World Institute for Nuclear Security. The president also on the sideline of the summit holds bilateral with the president of Denmark on security and economic issues. President Obama is leaving office in the next few months. And beyond this summit, he says he will continue to work with other organizations that have anything to do with reducing nuclear threats to achieve world peace. From the Walter Washington International Conference Center in Washington, D.C., Chukuma Omekusi, Channels Television News.